Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and how are you today? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, here's the daily crumb to help you along your way. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of the day this is for you. Later on in the morning for me. I've had some tears already. Um, yeah. Release. Ebb and flow. Yeah, gotta feel it. Let them go. I also just saw some news there, so my heart's going out. Extended family who just lost her husband five days ago. Feel my heart. My heart is with you, my foo. I was just a young man, too. <laughs> Anyways. We never know how much time we have here. No matter what you would believe, we get this one life, this one time. And at the end, it's... Uh, the regrets of what we didn't do. It's not what we did do. I don't know what is that for you. <laughs> anyway, let's get into a daily crumb and go. I think I'm gonna go do an intimate closet talk today to get into these the feelings, right? Dive a little deeper inside. Something that you know we'll all have these. Come. We're humans. We're all gonna go through all these emotions different times in our lives, we're going to experience them. It's not going to experience them the same way. We're all each our own. In the vinyls. <sighs> Sweet Jesus, God, on all our love and relations. Those flip right over, but there's one's going to come out. There we go. Yeah, I did a little... That's the one we go with. As you grow older, you will discover that you have two hands. One for helping yourself and one for helping others. Maya Angelou, reflect on some ways you helped others today. How did you feel when you helped them? All right? We share sharing sorrows lessens them. Sharing joys multiplies them. Mmm, right? We are not the only ones to go through losses, but in that moment, right? That is our that's our loss. It's tough. Anyone had a lot of losses over the years myself. Just the last few years, major <laughs> big ones. Some actually on the other side wrote. Some just choosing kill our relationship or whatever. And in different relationships, family, friends. It's tough, right? You gotta clear out to be refilled again. Okay, deep dimes there. That's, uh, he came up again. So that one, rites of passage and the change, okay. Yeah, you want the reflections, okay. I know, that was blue heron again. These all came up together. War bonnet was yesterday, and the hawk is the missing. Okay, and the storyteller. We're gonna keep hawk up here, too. It's the messenger, right? And then here we have the law. That's the spiritual laws, right? And the storyteller. We had those times. We had those stories, those memories. We share, share those. And they live on in that. They always will live on in that. 432. Okay, so see, I went for another. And we have the rice of, pa rice. Rice of passage. Rites of passage, change. There's always going to be change, right? We walk that red road. We leave behind the cradle board. We walk. We come to the adult the earth, and then we, you know, have to do that crossover to the rainbow bridge, and we go to that other side road. That's the rites of passage. We will, you know, we go through the birth waters when we come in. There's waters when we exit, but that is the rites of passage. The change. The only thing constant is change. Oh. You can count on that. And then we do those deep dives inside for reflection. What does this say to us? This grief, right? Because the grief is about us. 
they've gone through pain and everything, they cross over to that other side road, you know, that's all peace and love and what's what's left is us and grieving that loss of the physicalness because the energy change changes and transforms. It's never gone. It's always there with us. In fact, we can be even closer to our loved ones after they've crossed over and we could do that deep dive in that self-reflection and see they're still they're still here. They're still a part of 